All right, and we're back on the road again. Woo. Cold, cold again. Yeah, it's insanely cold, cold but let's look at those mountain ranges over there. I'm afraid to walk out to there because it looks like you just go in the water. I know, right? But yeah, so it's the next day. We're headed back to we're headed back to Tony's cabin, right? Yeah. For, yeah, we're headed back there first, and then either tomorrow or Saturday, then we head down to Oslo. But we want to take a quick stop because, no surprise, we found a beautiful landscape like, yet again, and just wanted to uh, get out, you know, appreciate Mother Nature and take some pictures. So yeah. No, it's insanely cold. It's crazy because like we look at the trees, <laughs> you're reminded of fall. But as soon as you look up, it's a little bit more, you see these mountains with snow on it, which is insane. Like snow and fall at the exact same time. I'm not used to seeing snow this early in the year though, to be honest. Oh man. Oh man. I'm out here, but I'm a little afraid. Man, it is cold out here. Seriously, like Oslo, I mean Oslo, Norway, I love you. This country is amazing, but I couldn't live here. Like, I barely survive Wisconsin's winters. There's no way, yeah, I'm not going over there, but there's no way I can survive winters here. Because Tony was telling me that it gets negative 30 degrees Celsius. That's insane. Like, for like a month straight, I couldn't do it. I can't, I'll fall into depression. I couldn't do it. I don't know about you, Ed. <sighs> This is bad. I don't think I can survive winter up here. No, I couldn't. I, I honestly give props to whoever can because this is like, it's only September and I think this is like bitter cold. Alright, so yeah, we're going to get more B-roll shots and whatnot and then, uh, yeah, get back in the van because it's going out here. Alright. So we're back in Tony's um, hometown. It's crazy because like literally two hours ago up north, it was insanely cold, and now it's like it's like a, almost like a summer spring day. And it's crazy how drastic this weather can change so quickly. It's crazy. But now I'm going to explore this church somewhere down here. <laughs> you didn't say it, Adidas. Adidas. This is like a perfect fall day. Yeah. I still can't get over like, how drastic that weather change was. <sighs> What's the name of this church again? Understand that, so yeah. Tips are freezing. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's 
get from not wearing a bra. Yeah. Right. I got no problem with that. I got mad pets, so. Yeah. Is this church open right now? I don't know if we can go in and back. I don't know if we can have one scene of wedding. How long ago was that? I was six years old. Wait, what? There's still rice at it. Yeah, we threw rice at married couples. Yeah. I feel like I've heard of that before. When they walk out, everybody's like, Not Adam, though. I would throw it so violently. Yeah, that's what we did. So we didn't know the tradition. So we, yeah, so I was like, everyone was like throwing at her instead of like up in the air. Oh, man. I remember just like. Okay, that's funny. We're gonna enter it. Oh no, we can go in there. Just I'm not sure if we can go inside. Some people use paint, but others use this, and this is the traditional way. Hmm. When you get this just right, peek through here, look straight to the altar. I don't think my camera's gonna let me focus. Come on. I'm not gonna get it. Come on. Okay, so it's pretty old. And then they rebuilt it. I just realized those horses are pretty. Oh, okay. You my horse? I'm also going to take you to the other church where, like my local church, that's also built, I think it'd be 1200 out of stone, like huge rocks. Mm. And they didn't have cranes and stuff. So what they did, they laid the rocks down. Yeah. And then they built. Soil there. Yeah. And then they had to take all the soil back. You know, I think that's the first time I've ever heard or seen a helicopter. Look at that. Yeah. That's a Grim Reaper. Yeah, that's the, that's the plague. Oh. So we had a plague in Norway called Svartedauen. It means the, the Black Death. And it killed over half of the country. So it was a play that uh, it gave you like huge wolves. Yeah, and then you died. So that's and that was a symbol of the plague, like a man with a uh, uh, grim reaper. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> like he came like the symbol of it was that he went from farm to farm and like killed people. How long ago? Before Christ. Yeah, that was. It's three thousand years ago. Wait, what's no? Oh wait, I take that back. This is going backwards. Yeah. So this is oh yeah, so like a thousand. So thousand this is Christ or like yeah, yeah, eighty. So five hundred after. Yeah, that was when they found the dude from. Before. Yeah. So that's 10,000 years ago. It's not even like that long. I'm like, when you think about it, the fact it's that like so they, long. yeah, but like they found that guy in the ice. 
or whatever, and it's like, I mean, it is a long time ago, but like, I know this is like the whole geologic time scale, so like, not much at all. It's crazy. It's very interesting.